we're going to have a, a young, economically active population in this, in this growing continent. And uh, so the, the issue is, how are we going to, is that going to be accompanied with economic growth? Because if, if this doesn't get accompanied with economic growth, we're not going to have the infrastructure that's required for all of those people. And essentially, Africa is going to become one huge slum, uh, which none of us can afford. And by the way, no one on the planet can afford that. So if you really want to get high level, I don't think anyone can even contemplate Africa not succeeding until 2050. It's just a prerequisite. And we'll, we'll talk about some of the things. And you know, our view at PPC is um, it, it's a portfolio of countries. It's not, a, it's not a continent per se for us. It's a portfolio of different countries, and it's going to be two steps forward, one step back. But ultimately, it will succeed, and you've got to position yourself to be a part of it. Um, the, the, next, the next big trend, obviously, that's going to go with it is, is urbanization, and when Africa will urbanize. And if you define urbanization as when a country reaches 50% of its population living in an urban area, um, if I remember the, the numbers, it happened in, the, in, in North America in the, in the 20s and in, in Europe, I forget, somewhere in the 50s, etc. For Africa, we're going to reach a level of 50% urbanization in, in about 2040. So we are probably, well, we are the least urbanized continent in the world. Um, and, and the urbanization is, is still coming. So not only do we have one of the highest population growth rates in the world, but we we have the highest urbanization rate in the world. So when you put that together, you've got all of these people moving into, into cities. By 2050, about 25% or a quarter of the world's urban population uh, will be living in Africa, um, compared to now, where it's, it's very, very, very low. Um, and about half of the people, half of the growth, growth in urban, urban people, so people from now until 2050, who go from a rural existence to an urban existence, half of those will come from Africa. And, and the amount of infrastructure that you've got to put into, into urban areas, therefore, half of, it, half of the world's spend on urban areas will probably come from Africa. So it's a, it's, a, it's a massive, massive ask. In fact, the number of people who will urbanize, which will be about uh, 1.3 billion, will be the equivalent to the 1.3, 1.4 billion people in China today. So essentially in 35 years, we've got to build a China in Africa, um, which is massive. And you think about the economic activity that's gone behind China, um, and that's got to happen in Africa. And, and that's the incredible, incredible thing about it.